Hi, and welcome. Please join me in a guided tour of a new agent-based modeling environment called StarLogo Nova. StarLogo Nova was produced by the Scheller Teacher Education Program, or STEP, at MIT. We are excited that you will be learning to use StarLogo Nova to teach about topics in Earth, Life, and Physical Sciences. In StarLogo Nova environment, you will be able to create, share, collaborate, and store your very own computer models on the web. So are you ready? Let's start having some fun with StarLogo Nova. First, you need to open your internet browser and navigate to www.slnova.org. I will walk you through the steps on how to set up an account. It's easy, and you'll be up and running in no time. So to create an account, click on the Register for an Account link. Choose a username and password. And you're going to want to enter an email address so that we can send you your password if you forget it. Once you have created your account, click on the My Profile link, then click the Create a New Project button to create a new project. We will be starting from a blank project, so choose that and then click Submit. This is the Star Logo Nova programming environment. At the top of the page is some information about the project, such as title, description, and author, which is you. Pretty cool. Change the title and description to be something useful. Below the project information is the 3D world where the model will run. We call this area Spaceland. The buttons in this area are used to control the model. You can move the view by dragging and scrolling your mouse. Why don't you go ahead and try it? Below Spaceland is the programming workspace, or blocks, where you will program the behaviors of your agents. So basically, here is what you're going to program, put your blocks, and tell them what to do. Here on the left are the drawers where you will find our commands for creating our program. Notice the drawers are full of command blocks. You create your program by dragging blocks from these drawers and connecting them together on the pages of the agents on the right. There are three different pages, one for the world, one for the agents other than the world, and one for the breeds. Pages are areas where you organize blocks to program the different agents. The user interface buttons in the Spaceland that control the simulation are linked to the command blocks in these pages. So for example, if I put a when setup push block on the world page, whenever the user pushes the setup block in Spaceland, the commands I placed within that block are run or executed. So basically whatever I told my program, my agents to do, when I click setup, they then follow those directions and run through the program. Now that you have taken a tour of the user interface, you can get started on the tutorial.